Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Michael and I just wanted to make this video real quick to show you how to play Brave as a Noun by Andrew Jackson Jihad or AJJ. Because like I had said in one of my previous videos, the way Sean Bonnet tends to play his guitar really comes off as intimidating, but if you give it time, you give it practice, like anything else in life, it's eventually going to get easier. So without further ado, the first thing you're going to need is obviously, boom, your guitar and I have mine in tune. Another thing um, that I really want to recommend is we're gonna we're not gonna be using a pick in this we're gonna be going pickless so you're gonna want to have your fingertips already desensitized and if you want some tips about that uh i made a previous video about the way sean bonnet plays his guitar um so i can try and link it to you right here and if i can't figure out how to do that just look it up um another thing that i want to recommend is if you haven't already go ahead and get a new pair of strings and why i recommend that is because when you're not using a pick um, sliding your fingers up and down these strings will create a lot of friction and will kind of start to create a burning sensation and it will impede your ability to keep on progressing because after a while it just becomes too painful to play honestly. Um, so yeah, go ahead and get a new pair of strings um, unless you can fight through it, you know, uh, more power to you. But, um, the last thing I want to recommend is good hand positioning and what I mean by that is whenever I play I don't keep my hands or my arm like off of here I kind of have it resting right here and the hand position that I want you to kind of try and keep in mind is like this little monkey claw kind of deal um, and what I mean by that is when you're strumming um, all these fingers are going up and down on those strings, right? And that's kind of going to create that dirty sound that Sean Bonnet is really renowned for. So, without further ado, this is how I interpret the Brave as a Noun, okay? second part maybe another video but um so starting out uh the first thing you're going to want to know is those chords and they're pretty basic so it's c a minor f and then g okay um and i'm coming at you as if you already have some experience playing guitar so uh pretty basic chords there um another thing uh or i should say after that it's going to be pretty simple the intro is just all down strums so so it's down, 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 and then a mute, right? I can go off the, and this is where it starts to become complicated. The strumming pattern for this song really sounds hard, but I'm gonna try and break it down really simple. It's gonna be up to you to work on that and then speed it up at your own pace, okay? So I'm gonna show you what I think the strumming pattern is. So it's, it's down, 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 So how that's going to sound in the song is like this. I could go off the deep end. My best friends. I could follow the stylish trends. Um, now, the strumming pattern that I presented to you is a guideline. Um, so in it's not going to be strictly that throughout the entire song and you'll kind of figure that out as you go so um but for the here and the now just practice that part because when you start to speed that up so in some of his live sessions and his studio sessions um, when he gets to that part when he's like and it's sad to know that we're not alone and it's sad to know there's no honest way when he hits that F chord he does this like down down wait 
How's it go? Down, 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 down. Something like that, just really fast. So, um, so let me try and break that down really slowly. So, start out slow with that. And then, obviously, speed it up at your own progression, so. In this life we lead, we could conquer everything. If we could just get the brain 